What's up everybody? Juice 5000 here with a review on the Droid Razor from Verizon. Made by Motorola. If I can get it open. Uh, I bought the white one, as you can see. Okay, there is the phone. Take the box open. Oh, data or USB. Here is your uh, charging USB block. It's got two in it. I have opened this already. That's why there's no plastic or uh, twist ties or anything. Um, yeah, nobody cares for the instructions. So let's not even bother. Uh, get this back together here and out of the way. Okay. It's uh real thin. Let's talk how thin this thing is. Look at this thing. It's like almost a quarter of an inch here, and I think this is around uh I don't know, five sixteenths. I mean, you're talking uh you're talking definitely a razor. You feel like you can throw this thing at the wall and it'll cut right into it. Shoots 1080p, high definition, front facing camera, 4.3 inch screen. Uh, let's see what else we got. Weighs, I think, four, four ounces, four and a half ounces. Got the Kevlar backing here. Very nice phone. It's thin, lightweight, got quite a bit of power in it. Here is your volume rocker power button the uh, sim card micro SD card slot no micro SD card in it okay let's turn this thing on oh wait headphone jack USB micro USB and HDMI supposed to be all red it's showing up yellow in the camera but other than that not a big deal 1.2 gigahertz dual core processor I'm not gonna do all the technical stuff that's weird why does it look yellow hmm oh well hmm Okay. Loss of service. Verizon Wireless. Alright, I mean this is all set up on my SIM card, so it's uh, got my personal stuff on it. Uh, I'm not too worried about that, really. Pretty smooth. I like it. It's, uh, very responsive takes great video and uh, the sound is really good and there's a text message not a big deal <laughs> Pretty uh, responsive. It's going to show not so great on the, my phone I'm recording on. Um, it looks better on the phone itself than on the phone I'm recording on. <clears throat> it's got autofocus. And uh, it's pretty good. It's got flash. So let's, uh, let's take a picture of the box. You can focus if you want. Okay, and here is the picture. 
Looks pretty dark actually. So let's do that again without the flash. And let's try this again. Okay. Yeah, not bad. It's pretty loud on uh, volume here. I'll play, uh, let's see, let's play a ringtone. <clears throat> let's do, what do we got? I got a test lab right now. I don't know. Right, let's just do the phone. Pretty loud. I think that's all the way up. Yep. Okay. Pretty loud. Uh, I can definitely hear it when I have it in my pocket. Um, I'll show you the keyboard. Hey, what's going on? And as you can see, hey, I got it with a W. Uh, and then we have the option to speak. What are you doing tonight? What are you doing tonight? Alrighty, did pretty good. Been very accurate at every text to speech. I'm happy with it. Uh, my brother uses it quite a bit and uh, saves on uh, text in here. Or typing anyways. Uh, I got 50% battery as you can see stated by this widget. And this even tells you the running temperature of the battery. 79 degrees right now. Okay. Uh, overall this thing has been awesome. I've only had it for a couple days but I have no issues at all. Alright, now you get this thing, it's a small investment. You're thinking, uh, what do I want to protect this thing with? Well, I'll show you what I got. I bought an OtterBox. It's in pieces right now. Okay. So, here you have the bottom of the outer box. You got this uh, hard plastic. It's thin but it's pretty hard. And then you got this foam here. Cushions the phone. Uh, you got your designated holes here. You got your, your speaker and your flash your camera. The other big speaker. Uh, let's see. And then you got your other speaker. Uh, actually, no, that hole isn't for a speaker, is it? No. Oh well. Uh, let's see. So here you go. Put this down. Let me adjust the camera. Put that down. I'm gonna clean the phone first, just because I feel like it. Clean your phone. Pop it in there like that. Fits real snug. Clean. Uh, clean your screen. I just put my fingers on it. Okay, you got the uh, clear plastic top here. You can almost not even see it. Clean that. Clean this side. This is going to be touched quite a bit on that side. Okay, snap it on. As long as you get lined up here. It's this, that one, that one, middle. Middle. Okay. Clean this again, just because I like to be clean. Alright, now we put on the rubber silicone outer skin here. Uh, 
Almost. Get his work this groove in here. Okay. There you go. It fits very nice. Looks good. <clears throat> Here's the back. It says Otterbox. Here's all your things right there. Okay. Alright, and then you got your holster here. Got your uh, belt clip or your pocket clip, whatever you're going to clip it on here. As you can see, one hook. This one's bigger than this one, so uh, you know, you put this in like so. Snap it in, ain't going to fall out, or not like that. Maybe uh, if you throw it a little bit harder, maybe. I've only had it fall out once. Um, then take it off, pop it off, put it back on, or you can put it on forward so you can look at the thing. You don't have to take it off every single time. Okay, uh, now let's talk about battery since I got this thing on. Battery's not too bad. It's at 50% now. I've had the data on all day. Uh, right now, let's see what time is this thing saying here. Saying 6.17. It is. Well, was there. 6.17 now. I uh, take it off to charge it at 6 o'clock. Uh, it's gone 12 hours, 50% battery. Uh, we're talking probably, I don't know, maybe 50 text messages, 100 text messages today. With uh, data being on all the time. Uh, Wi-Fi being on all the time also. Uh, let's see what else we got. Uh, taking a couple pictures. Uh, I mean, it's, it's been using it a little bit. It's probably not as much as some people, but um, and being on the data, I don't use, don't go on that too much. Um, not too bad battery life. Uh, as you can see, this case also kind of doubles with a kickstand with the uh, clip staying open here. It's got a hold open here or you can put it down like this and uh, if you want to text down or whatever think of something else to do uh, but uh, yeah I use it for that if I show somebody be like hey look at that it's like oh okay that's cool and then I take it off pull it let it go back and a pretty pretty springy spring in there so uh, it's built very good so you have uh, you have my thoughts on it. Uh, if you want to get one, probably should. If you can't afford it, it's not a problem. Uh, there are many other phones out there. Uh, personally, I this has probably been the best one I've owned so far over the past seven years. So, uh, oh, all right. Well, there you go, Droid Razor.